Hello, Jayvanth. Today, we are going to discuss about the question, see here, find the smallest square number that is divisible by each of the numbers 4, 9, 10. So, here we are going to find out smallest square number. Okay, sir. That square number must be divisible by 4, 9, 10. Okay, it must be divisible. They mentioned smallest means. First, here I am going to find out LCM. LCM means what? Already you know that is least common multiple, right? Common factor. Yes. LCM of 4, 9, 10 I am going to find. So, already we know how to find out the LCM of 4, 9, 10. Which table it will go? Like C2, 2, First 2, two table. table. And then 5. Yes. Again. Then 3 table. Yes. 2, 3, yes. 5. So now you can stop here. Why? Because 2, 3, 5 are the prime numbers. Na? You no need to go ahead with 2 table, 3 table, 5 table. Yes? Na? So yeah, usually we need to get until last 1, 1, 1. You no need to do that. Okay. Finally, now I want to know the LCM of 4, 9, 10. How much it is? We need to multiply all of them. Yes. Very good, Jayvan. Now, if I multiply, what I got here? See, 2, 3 is a 6. 6, 2 is a 12. 12, 3 is a 24. 6 is a 36 into 5. Yes. Which is 180. Uh, how, how much? What is the answer it is? 2, 3, 6, 6, 12, 12, 180. 36, 36, 5 is a 180. 180. Yes, right? Very good. But now tell me, Jayvanth, here, 180 is a 180 is a prime number. Sorry, 180 is a square number? No, sir. No. Why? Because here the question, what they asked here? Smallest Find the smallest square. square. 180. Why, why it is not a square number? Already we know the squares. 12 square, 144. 13 square, 169. 14 square, 196. But it's it is not, not a square number. So that time what we are going to do here. 180, we are going to do a prime factorization. So then we can understand, okay, which smallest number if I multiply with the 180, it will become a square number. So now I am yes. going to prime factorization. 290s are again, 45s are again, 315 is 3 5s. Right? Yes. Now 180, I can write 2 into 2 into 3. 2 into 3 into 3 five. into 5. Here observe Jayvanth carefully. If suppose I need square number, right? If I need square number means what? Usually here I, what I required? Pairs required. Here 2 is in pairs, 3 is but, in pairs. But 5 is not in pair. So, if not I multiply with the 5, 180 and into 5, number, then definitely I will get a square number, right? Number. Now, yes, what I am going to do in the next step, why? Because 5 is not available, right? So, what I am going to do, 180, and 180 into 5, 5 and this number right side also I am going to multiply with 5. 5. Now, I can say this is in pairs, right? See? So, yes. Pairs. So, 185 is a how much? So, 900 I got. 100. So, 185 is a 900. So, now, so, we know that 30 square is 900. So, yes, yes, very 2 good. into 3 into 5. Ah, yes, 2 into 3 into 5 we can read. But they are asking smallest square number. Right? So, 900 we got. Now, this is nothing but what we know already 30 square. 30 square. So, so, now my conclusion is, therefore, 900 is the smallest, smallest square number. number. And is divisible. Smallest square number, number. divisible that is so it is divisible by it is four by divisible four, by four nine ten and so ten. giving a final conclusion it is divisible by four nine ten okay but exactly divisible see it is divisible by four exactly it is divisible by nine exactly it is divisible by 10 also exactly. Even you can ask me, sir, 180 also divisible, na, sir. Suppose you can ask me, sir, we got LCM, na. 180 also divisible. But 180 is divisible. But the thing is, they ask in the question, smallest square number. That's why we are going this method. Okay, I hope you understood, Jayvanth. Yes, sir. Okay, thank you.